Are you drinking Coca-Cola? Don't you know it's unhealthy? Who cares? Everybody's drinking it. The Timeline Founded in 1894, Coca-Cola has more than 125 years of experience and in 1978, Coca-Cola introduced the world to the 2-liter PET plastic bottle, which is a recyclable bottle. In 2000, they introduced the glass bottles, which are 40% stronger and 20% lighter than the original bottle and saved approximately 52,000 million tons of glass in 2006. In 2009, Coca-Cola launched the innovative plant bottle in the US, a completely recyclable PET container made with plant materials which include sugar cane extracts. In 2011, Coca-Cola intends to go green globally. Plant bottle packaging is available in 9 countries with launches planned for many additional markets in 2011 and beyond. Have you ever wondered how these raw materials transform into a bottle of Coca-Cola right in front of you? Plant Bottle is Coca-Cola's latest breakthrough innovation in packaging. It's the first ever fully recyclable PET plastic beverage bottle made partially from plants. The key difference between Plant Bottle packaging and traditional PET plastic bottles is that instead of using petroleum and other fossil fuels to produce a key ingredient in the plastic, up to 30% of Plant Bottle packaging is made from renewable plant-based material and it is 100% recyclable. In essence, we are trading fossil fuels for plant-based material without sacrificing performance or recyclability. Materials from the plant bottle can be reused and this helps to save our planet's precious resources. Water is a precious resource. It is also the main ingredient of all Coca-Cola products. Throughout the operations in the global supply chain and beyond, Coca-Cola remain deeply committed to water stewardship to enable them to build and maintain a truly water-sustainable business and to further the science and practice of water conservation. Coca-Cola adopts water stewardship to safely return to nature and communities an amount of water equivalent to what they use in their beverages and production. The four R's consist of Replenish Reduce Recycle and Risk Management In the past, Coca-Cola's refrigerant gases mainly emit CFC, which result in the depletion of ozone layer. Coca-Cola announced that 100% of their new vending machines and coolers will be HFC-free by 2015. Coca-Cola is using two HFC-free solutions. Hydrocarbon refrigeration is used in smaller refrigeration equipment and carbon dioxide is used in larger equipment. As a result, it improves energy efficiency by 40% and this will result in reduction of 52 million tons of carbon emissions, the equivalent of taking more than 11 million cars off the road for one year. Now, Coca-Cola has invested more than 50 million in R&D to advance the use of climate-friendly cooling technologies and they innovated a climate-friendly cooler that uses a natural gas refrigerant that reduces direct greenhouse gases emission by 99%. Coca-Cola has invested directly in 7 plastic bottle to bottle recycling plants. The system of Coca-Cola has contributed hundreds of millions of dollars towards collection of bottles and cans for recycling.